Hey guys, it's Mike Wall again. And in today's market with home prices rising and a lack of inventory, some homeowners may try and consider selling their home on their own in the industry known as a for sale by owner or FISBO. There are several reasons why this might not be a good idea for the vast majority of sellers. Here are the top five reasons. Number one, exposure to prospective buyers. Recent studies have shown that 95% of buyers search online for a home. That is in comparison to only 17% at print newspaper ads. Most real estate agents have an internet strategy to promote the sale of your home. Number two, results come from the internet. Where did buyers find the home they actually purchased? 49% on the internet, 31% from a real estate agent, 7% from a yard sign, 1% from newspapers. The days of selling your house by just putting a sign and putting it in the paper are long gone. Having a strong internet strategy is crucial. Number three, there are too many people to negotiate with. Here are a list of some of the people whom you'll be negotiating with if you decide to sell your home for sale by owner. The buyer who wants the best deal possible, the buyer's agent who solely represents the best interest of the buyer, the buyer's attorney in some parts of the country, the home inspection companies, which work for the buyer and will almost always find some problems with your house. Number four, FISBOing has become more and more difficult. The paperwork involved in selling and buying a home has increased dramatically as industry disclosures and regulations have become mandatory. This is one of the reasons that the percentage of people FISBOing has dropped from 19% to 8% over the last 20 plus years. Number five, you net more money when using an agent. Many homeowners believe that you will save the real estate commission by selling the house on their own. Realize that the main reason buyers look at FISBOs is because they also believe they can save the real estate agent's commission. The seller and buyer can't both save the commission. A study by Collateral Analytics revealed that FISBOs don't actually save anything and in some cases may be costing themselves more by not listing with an agent. If more buyers see a home, the greater the chances are that there could be a bidding war for the property. The study showed that the difference in price between comparable homes and the size and location is currently at an average of 6% this year. Why would you choose to list on your own and manage the entire transaction when you can hire an agent and not have to pay anything more? Bottom line, before you decide to take on the challenges of selling your house on your own, sit with a real estate professional in your marketplace and see what they have to offer. This is Mike Wall with Keller Williams. Thanks again for watching.